Baker and welcome to Titley's Busy Kitchen with me, Titley Nihan. Pop quiz! What's the difference between eggs Benedict and eggs Florentine? Answer? Not a lot. Both use hollandaise sauce, both use English muffins and both use eggs. Let me out! Let me out! I'm going to make supper for two people with this lot. So I've got four eggs, two English muffins, for the eggs Florentine I've got 100 grams of baby spinach and for the eggs Benedict you'd normally use slices of back bacon or something like that but since I don't eat pork I've got four rashes of halal salami. To make a hollandaise sauce you'll need two egg yolks, 125 grams of butter, two teaspoons of white vinegar and two teaspoons of lemon juice. Place a bowl over a pan of simmering water, the bottom of the bowl mustn't touch the water. Add in the egg yolks, the vinegar and the lemon juice and beat well with a whisk. It's going to take about five minutes to do this. Meanwhile, gently melt the butter in a pan. Once the eggs start to thicken, remove them from the heat and season with a little salt and pepper. As soon as the butter is melted, add it very slowly into the eggs with lots of whisking. Now, temperature is all important in making a hollandaise and if you get it wrong, if you get it too hot or too cold, it can curdle. There are some tips on my website on how to deal with that. Making a good hollandaise certainly gets your whisky muscles going. But of course if you can't be bothered with any of this then just go out and buy a packet mix. That's all the butter added and there's my nice creamy hollandaise sauce. Now I'll just set it back over a pan of hot water to keep it warm while I deal with the eggs and the muffins. Now I'll split my muffins in half with a sharp knife and toast them under a grill. Once they're lightly toasted, remove from the grill. Then lightly grill your meat slices. Looking good. Cook the spinach by putting a small amount of water in a pan, bringing it to the boil and then dropping the spinach in. Now cover and cook for three or four minutes to wilt the spinach. After three or four minutes the spinach should have wilted so you can take this away and drain it and squeeze it dry with the back of a spoon. Now onto one muffin put your meat and onto the other put half the spinach. To poach the eggs you can either use an egg poacher or bring a large pan of water to a gentle boil. Add in two teaspoons of white vinegar then break an egg into a ramekin and gently slide it into the water. After two minutes, rescue the eggs very carefully with a slotted spoon and pop them gently onto the spinach or the meat. Then spoon on some delicious hollandaise sauce. You're scaring me now. Eggs Florentine and Eggs Benedict. It's what suppers and breakfasts are made of. I've given lots of variations of the same basic recipe on my website, so go and take a look. Join me next time in Titley's Busy Kitchen with me, Titley Nihar. Until next time, good happy.